Mira, I was oh. worried. Oh. How was it? Cersei has a way of looking at you as though you're nothing. Uh, it's it went well. Intimidating. It went it very went well. well. Really? That's a relief. Cersei is known for being rather difficult. Nah, she's a bitch. Lady Marjorie has spent the entire day working on seating arrangements for the wedding. Ooh. Of course, you and I are seated way at the back. Here with the fourth cousins and the ninth born sons. Now, we get to see their booties. <sighs> Sir Jamie, I wouldn't mind tarnishing that white cloak of his. <laughs> what? It's true. And Oberyn Martell, the red viper. Uh. I'm told he has a paramour. Oh, well, he's he very handsome. He's quite so. handsome and quite passionate, from what I've heard. Hmm. Perhaps Lady Marjorie could make the right introductions. Who knows? We might meet our future husbands. <gasps> Although, marrying a king... Don't get my hopes up. imagine what that would be like. Would you marry Joffrey if it huh. meant you'd become queen? Do you even have to ask? He does have a certain look about him. No. I'd be willing to marry, but I'm not marrying Joffrey. that little evil shit. Well, I would marry him. Imagine the power you would have as Queen of the Seven Kingdoms. I might even allow Not you to worth be my it. handmaiden. <gasps> Aww. Bestie. Let's see. Who else should we marry off? Brienne of Tarth and Tyrion Lannister. <laughs> what a perfect match. Nah, she's for Jamie. Sir and... What are you doing? Sir Bron and her. What about Sir Bron and Marjorie? Well... We were just having oh, sorry, a bit of fun. We were just having fun. This is not a game. It's a battle plan. Allies and enemies can be made with every move. Yet they say it is men who are powerful. Yeah, they don't know shit. The Queen was rather disappointed by your display, Mira. Ah, don't fucking care. I'm just glad it's over. Me too. King's I was Landing hoping that could slap her. Sometimes. You got There's that always right. someone to please or some perceived slight to smooth over. Yeah, let's go back to I High Guard. only get worse when I am queen. Once they know your true heart, the lords and ladies will have no choice but to love you. Do you agree? Uh, uh you know what? I'll be a suck up too. Sarah's Once you're right. Queen, Sarah's the right. ladies will do their best to please you. You learn very quickly. Your words to Cersei were brave, but I know you must fear what the Boltons might do to your family. Nah, fuck them. I do appreciate your willingness to appease her, as difficult as it may have been. Thank you, my lady. There's been something on my mind. Something important. Hmm. Uh, I... I did have a favor to ask of you in return. Yeah. Like, you scratch you my back, say, I'll scratch say yours. In front of Sarah. There are no secrets between us. It's about my family. What? I trust her. Yeah. I trust her too. Sarah may stay. Go on. Ask. My mother needs our help. Forgive me, my lady. I wouldn't otherwise ask this of you, but my mother insisted. It's about my family. Hmm. Ramsay Snow. What would you have me do? Chop your my fucking head off. My mother fears our off. family will suffer if Ramsay is left to do as he likes. <clears throat> she thought, if a raven could be sent to the Boltons to let them know House Forrester has the protection of the crown, <gasps> I know perfect. it's a lot to ask of you. And I wouldn't otherwise, but... She insisted. Please. That is no small request. Oh, come Especially on. Especially now. I know, my lady. And I wouldn't ask this of you otherwise. But my mother has left me no choice. She insisted. Joffrey knows only too well your family fought for the Starks. And now you would have me ask him to intervene. Come on, please. Is the situation that dire? You can't, my lady. What? King Joffrey won't Zira. like it. Just think how we turned on Lady Sansa. 
I'll be in your debt. I will forever be in your debt. My family. I never said will forever. forever be in your debt. I never said family. Stop it. I don't know, Mira. If uh, Cersei were to find out. Come on. So is that it? I scratch your back, you fuck me over. Don't fear Cersei. Don't Who cares about her? You have Fuck power her. over him, Lady Marjorie, as no one else does. Yeah. Not even his mother. If you know what I mean. Ramsay Snow will arrive at Ironrath within the week. I would never ask this of you if it weren't so urgent. Come on, please. Very well. Yes. I'll make your request, but I cannot promise anything. Thank uh, you, my lady. We did it. I will send a raven to my family at once. Hmm. What was the point in getting Lord Tyrion's help then? Oh, we're back on the King's Road with truffles. Hmm. Sounds like there's a party around here. Whoa. Ah. Uh, Alright, bye. Seven hells. Uh, seven fucking hells, mate. Uh, what's going on? Let's play a little game, shall we? Ramsey Bolton. Was it Ramsey Snow? Their enemies as a coat. Why do we need to look at this? Not my best Wait, is that Theon? Is that Freon Grage? Whoa! I, suppose I, have fallen out I did not notice him there. But he didn't make it easy. What with all that laying out again? Noise. <laughs> like a drowning cat. What's the point? I he never we can we can hear him As from there. As my father likes to say, a naked uh, man there he goes holds again. few secrets, but the flayed man, the flayed man holds none. Pity he didn't know your father. That bullshit, mate. If you can fly in he someone, they're now. just going to say anything to make this pain stop. How much further is it to these foresters? Oh, fuck. Uh, a day, my lord. Two at most. He's actually going what there. Oh, uh, that's a branch just snapping. Yes. Doesn't mean there was someone there. Could have been an animal. No way your instinct's there. that sharp. Oh, shit. Hear that? Uh, I know I heard something. Run, I'll stay still. Stay still. That will definitely see me up and run. Oh, was that the right thing to do? I don't think... Oh, shit. I don't think it was. Never mind. Oh. We've wasted enough time already. Oof. For a second, I thought I was going to be joining Fionn Greyjoy. <laughs> Jesus. That was kind of terrifying. Oh no. Hmm. Wait, did you just leave Theon? Dude, what do we even need to go up to him? Theon! Uh, that's not Fionn. Fionn doesn't have a moustache. Or well, if he does, it's a shit one. What'd you expect, man? It's Ramsay. <laughs> Alright, so we're back at Iron Wrath. Hmm. Lord Ethan. As Hello. I was saying, you are young. Yeah, I get that. And there are those within these walls who are uncertain of your leadership. Ah, freaking just lock them up but in the shackles then. 300 generations of Forester Lords stand behind you. Really? That much? Lord Gerhard the Tall, who founded our house. And your grandfather, Lord Thorin the Bold, who seized back the river valley from the White Hills. 
What did they call my father? Hmm. Lord Gregor the Good. Lord Gregor, Gregor the Good. Ah. He was fair and wise, and courageous. What do you reckon they'll call and me? What would they call me? That is for you to define as the new lord. Ah. These were your father's people to lead and protect. Dragon Slayer Nine Thousand. That's what they're going to call me. Did not bear this responsibility alone. He and every forester lord before him chose one man whom they trusted above all others, the Lord Sentinel. Ah. Forester traditions demand that a new Lord Sentinel must be chosen. Ah. Keep walking, you craven son of a whore. Move. Ah, what's going on? Summon the Lord. We need his judgment. I've done nothing wrong. I was only trying to survive. Now, what's all this about needing my judgment? Lord Need Ethan. my judgment. Missed. You spoke of judgment, Sir Royland. What judgment is that? This what's craven this is a deserter and a thief. What? You stole from us. This house is doomed! We all fucking know it! Quiet, Shut up. Thief. Eric was supposed to be guarding our weapons, but instead we caught him stealing them. You stole our weapons? Two shields and three spears. Is Sir Royal mistaken? Said, true. Yes, my lord. I fled. We should all flee. It's not stealing if you're taking what's yours by right. He speaks He's true. Right. What are you talking about? Defeat. They're not two coins to rub together since Lord Gregor left us to rot here. Where's our pay? Our share of bread and wine grows smaller every day. Leave the poor man That's alone. what the coins are for, bro. That's Lord why Ethan, you have to work for your money. I know these words are hard, but they're honest. This house is falling. We'll never survive the coming winter. Then you admit to then the you crime. Admit to the crime in front of all gathered here. I am only what this house made me. You cannot expect a man to live on loyalty alone. <clears throat> You'll address him as Lord. Yeah. Royal and that. Lord Eath. So what should we do here about him? Lord Gregor always took a thief's fingers. Three of them. Now may not be the time for harsh punishment. The men are on edge as it the is. Men need hmm. to know they cannot do whatever the fuck they please. Their Lord will not permit it. Yeah, Royland's right. Send him to the war. We're not sending him to the... Stop sending people to the wall, Duncan Trump. Oh, you got shitty advice, decide. man. Send him to the wall. Take his fingers. He's a thief. If you punish me, you'll be punishing an innocent man. What? No. You were stealing our weapons. That's not. Please. No. My lord. My family depends on me. Hmm. I could send you to the wall with truffles. Nah, it's harsh times, I, mate. Ethan of House Forest. It means harsh Lord punishments. Of Wrath, name you a thief. I'm taking your fingers, mate. It's three of your fingers. No, oh, please, my lord. My lord, please. Please, no. I'm sorry if it was food. My lord. No it would have been different, but weapons. What were you up to with weapons? I am willing to carry it out. Nah, bro. I'm the Lord. I'll it. carry out the punishment. I will carry out the sentence. <laughs> this is injustice, my Lord! And what would you know about justice, mate? Alright. I hope you learnt your lesson. Don't ever do that again. Well, next time... It'll be your other hand, and when you run out of fingers, it'll be your toes. Oh. Oh no. Am I gonna get yelled at by people? That was certainly unpleasant, but a lord must meet our punishment when it's due. Oh, thanks. Not just yourself, of course. Uh, it's a lord's duty. It is. So I did it. You heard what the thief said. I expect this sort of thing will happen again. But a sentinel can help you in the face of disloyalty. Hmm. You need someone you can trust by your side. I was thinking about Royland. Someone you can rely on, no matter the circumstance. Possessing wisdom, 
Who, Who would you, you choose? choose? Let me pick your brain. There are two capable men for the role. They so both want the job. Duncan. Neither thinks and very Roland. highly of the other. How do I decide between them? Talk to them. Solicit the opinion of people close to you. Alright. Here. Hmm. The bracer of the sentinel. The oh. badge of office. That's bass. Tonight oh, that's is your first badass. school council meeting. It would be wise to bestow this bracer upon your chosen sentinel then, to show that you are decisive and in control of this house. Oh, well, thank you. Your sentinel will wear this for I'll make the right choice. It. I'll make the right choice as sentinel. Can I be my own sentinel? Because I wouldn't mind wearing that. Come speak with me when you're ready to convene the small council, my lord. Ah, oh, will do. I'll catch you later. All right, then. How do you feel in your pocket? Hmm... I reckon it's going to be you, mate. Oh, I don't even think I'm picking you. You keep sending people to the wall. Alright. What do we got? Who am I going to talk to? Oh, little, little Riot. Oh, let's talk to you. Oh, what are you doing? Making yourself a little sword? Oh. Oh, I didn't talk to him much. Careful. Before, Keep at it and you won't have much left. Something to pick your teeth with. No, Ethan. Look at this. All good swords have a name. I call mine Two Brothers. I Aww. carved this to give me strength. And this, Aww. so I remember. I mean, I could never forget, but... Oh. Roderick would be proud, you know, mate. You, you honour Roderick with this. He was a strong one. He was. You'll get Someday, there, mate. I'll have a real one. But not oh. like that one. Only a lord could have that sword. Oh, no. You'll you, have a good sword. You're going to have sure a great sword, mate. I watched we're, you today. We're going to get you Valerian steel. I saw what steel. you did to that man. Aww. Was he our enemy? Um, a in man. a way, he was. Everyone keeps talking about them. I must enforce our rules. Rules mean nothing if we don't enforce them. It doesn't matter if he's good or bad. You can't steal. That's a rule. Well, I yeah. say he was bad. Bad men killed Father and Roderick. They need someone to hurt them back. Even worse. Ah, see, you got it. That's a real sword. No one's afraid of wood. I'll find the men who took Roderick someday, and I'll make sure I have a real sword when I do. Vampires are scared of wood, mate. You know what? You got the right spirit. Do you want to be my sentinel? No, I can't pick you, unfortunately. Alright, let's have a look. Port... Port Collis. Is that what the region we're in? Hmm. Unless we've got a tiny little bit of a view. Better than nothing. Alright. Food. Let's look at our food. Are we gonna have enough? Our provisions are rather low, my lord. Yeah. I, I made the count that. again, just to be sure. Oh, look at that. But it doesn't look good. Has Is anything else missing? missing? No. Doesn't look that way. Seems hmm. Eric was the only one to resort to thievery. But I'm still worried about our stores. See? We couldn't withstand a if he was the lord. first, and we would have let him get away with it, cut us off and wait us out. everybody would have started. Well, and now there we send an example. We can take. In the past, we've demanded food from the small folk to replenish our stores. We can do it again if mm. you like. We've done it before in desperate times. The last long winter, my family had to give all our. There must be something else. else. No, there must be something else we can do. Well, I hope we find it soon. We won't have much room to maneuver if we don't have the option of holding fast. I can speak to the huntsmen and trappers. Perhaps they can do more. Yes. My lord. The food's... If food's starting to... Shrink... Now, then, we, then everyone's got to talk more. Oh, have I still got to talk to you? Duncan. Yes, my lord. I have much to consider and face a difficult decision. Yeah, I do. Perhaps I can help. Your father often sought my counsel. Really? Oh, let's have a look. Of course. 
And if I may ask, who do you favor for the role? Perhaps I can share my insight. Ah, oh, so Sir Roiland. Do you trust him? He's a fine warrior, my lord, but he's nowhere near ready to serve a sentinel. What is I that? Do not trust him. He's likely to lose his temper and get us all killed, and at nah. the worst possible time. He's the right person Thank for you, your sentinel. Duncan. I appreciate your advice. I'm at your service, my lord. Hmm. I saw something about Garrod. No. Alright. Like Malcolm. Who's Malcolm? Hello. Apparently, I've got to ask you what about. I say, Lord Ethan. Ooh, Hello, Uncle shit. Malcolm. I saw what you did today. It's not an easy thing to uh, do. Oh, you're not going to give me a hard time. Harsh punishment, no matter how warranted. Oh, I had to do it. Or but would have. If you'll excuse me, my lord, I should finish packing before nightfall. Everyone else would have started. I hope to be off tomorrow. Where are you off to? Where are you going? Your mother asked me to cross the narrow sea to find your brother, Asher. Asher? What? Asher? She has asked me to return with him. To help the house. She said nothing of this to me. Because she fears you will not agree. Oh, no. I told her my place is here. But I'll be of no help to you, in Essos. The more help she we get, the better. I will hold, of course. Until you've spoken with her about this. Just try to be kind to her. She's been living a nightmare made real. Oh, of course, you know she's my mom. Well. I'm not going to go off with her. I'll she's be my gentle. Mother. Of course, I'll be gentle. I know you will. You're good-hearted, my lord. That is your true strength. Well, thank but you. But my mother's fears are not the only ones I face. My people are scared as well. I'm told I must choose a sentinel. Yeah. If I may be so bold, Sir Royland is the man for the job. Yes. That's exactly who, I, fine who I was thinking. You're right about Sir Roiland. Sir Roiland seems the man for the job. We are at war. You need a warrior by your side. Roiland has the respect of his men and will bring strength and discipline to this house. And he's not going to send any of our men to the war. Advice, but now is not the time to negotiate. Thank you, Uncle. Ethan, I need You're to right. talk to you. Thanks, Malcolm. I'll see you when you get back. You're not going to go off me, are you? Mother told me Mira's oh. asked for Lady Marjorie's help. Oh, Did that's she? great. I knew we could rely on Mira. She always thinks of family above all else. Hopefully Lady Marjorie's influence will be enough. But right I'm now sure I'm more will. concerned about you. I mean, she's marrying the king for I God's sake. I saw what you did to that man. Oh, come on. The way you punished him? Come on. How could you be so cruel? That's not cruel. I'm worried about you. What am I supposed to think? Stand by I my did decision. what I had to, and I stand by it. Set an example. like it was the only thing to be done. I know you told me you'd have to change, but I suppose I hadn't believed you would. I can't afford any more mistakes. Everyone knows what happened with Lord Whitehill. Garrod being sent to the wall without my knowledge. I know. And that wasn't your fault. Well, I'm the Damn Lord. Straight, it wasn't my it's fault. It's my responsibility. The Everyone being snidey me on they my back. To, but... What? Ethan, please. Tell me. I wish father were here. I, I wish father were here. We all do, but father is gone. You are the lord of this house, which is why you must be strong. You're oh, just I am as strong. capable as Asher or Roderick ever were. I know it. Oh. Oh, nice I only say. wish you did too. You have always given me good advice. Thank you. But not a bit. Nah, no. Nah. Not about the whole punishment thing. That's not sage. That's not good advice. Bad advice. All right. So it looks Go like you're up. the last one to talk to, Sir Roiland. Sorry. Look at you. Wrong. I didn't know so dogs can old sword. Training your men of while course, Duncan's man. just sitting on his ass. Good work. I have many decisions to make, and I wanted your advice. And I think I've made it. I need a sentinel, and I, I want it to, to be you. Sentinel. Ah, you do. And it's good you came to me. You're one of the I boys, Royland. And everyone here knows me. They know I can hold the reins, 
or wield the sword in equal measure. Exactly. I'm the man you need. And might I remind you, it was Duncan Tuttle who sent Gallant to the wall. Oh no, you don't need to remind me of that. And made you look weak to the White Hills. Yep. I would never do that to you. And if you pardon me, you know what? He's actually he's screwing me. Your father would be proud. Your words are your words very wise, wise, Sir Royland. Sir Royland. Thank you, my lord. I will consider them as I make my choice. Yeah. So, when will you declare your decision, my lord? Uh, tonight. Tonight. Council meeting. Yeah. Very good. I trust your judgment, my lord. Uh, and you should be pleased, because you're going to be my new sentinel. Good old. Oh wait, can I just give it to I've you now? I decided to name you as my sentinel, Sir Roland. Thank you, my lord. But are you sure? Oh damn straight, mate. Here yes, you go. Of course. Yeah, I'll have I'm you gone. Convinced you're the man for the job. Then I accept. But you must summon the small council, my lord, to make it official. Right. I'll tell Maester Ortengren to do it at once. Uh. Alright, let's find this guy. Where is he? So switch my uncle, switch to her. Can we go past this car? Nope. Switch to you. Oh, I'll give you the brace. I'll give you some Duncan, false hope. I've decided to name you as my sentinel. Yeah! Congratulations. There you go. I, thank you, my lord. I'm honoured. But are you sure? Yeah, yes. yeah. Of course. I'm convinced you're the man for the job. Then I accept. But first, you must summon the small council, my lord, to make it official. Right. Oh, sure I'll thing. tell Maester Ortengrin to do it at once. I'll see you in there. Alright, bro. I've made my mind up. I'm picking my sentinel. Let's call that small council. Maester? Yes, Lord Ethan. I see you've spoken to a number of people. Are you prepared to name your sentinel? Why, yes, yes I am. Yes, Mister, I'm ready. Very well. I will convene the small council at once. Let's go. All right, bitches, council meeting. Let's get going. 